Hey everybody, welcome to another Let's Play with me, RC, here on GGRC. Today we're going to be checking out Big Farm Story. And this looks like a very cute, casual type of game where you kind of sit back and just build your own farm at your leisure. Um, I know that recently it was announced that Farmville will be kind of on the rocks, going away. So for those of you looking for like a new farming simulator that's kind of a little bit more light, this looks like it might be the ticket for you. Keep in mind this is available on Steam in early access at the moment, so it's not a finished game. Anything you see here today, you know, it's it's gonna give you a good idea of what to expect in the final game, but it's not all completely final. Um, but with knowing that, why don't we jump right in here? You know, I like a good casual game every now and then. I think I've talked about this on the channel before. But every now and then, it's fun to just get into, like, a nice, simple game to pass the time with, you know? Let me turn on the sound here. Are we done now, Grandpa? Farm work is never finished, little one, of course. It's what I hear. But for today, we're almost done. See those carrot plants? I see them. Why don't you harvest those last ones for me? I sense a tutorial coming in. And here, four brand new seeds to sow afterwards. All right. Shall we? You want me to do it all alone? I'm certain you'll do great. Here, go ahead. Okay, so you click on it. Click the carrot. Boom. There you go. Done and done. Oh, they want you to do it in a certain order. Okay. We have collected the carrots. No big whoop. Now, those plants... Those plants will need water. See the well. It's a very nice well. You can get water from there. Alright. Hey, now we can run. Alright, so we got water. Oh, now we got water. You gotta click the icon. Great. Now just plow the field and plant a seed. Okay. You click it, hit plow, plant. Five minutes. There we go. We water and now we begin. Okay. So we'll repeat the whole thing. Works for me. It's a very well-tended, beautiful garden. Like, look at the way everything is just, like, perfectly laid out and everything. It's the way one would wish their garden would look when they're finished. But I'm not sure in real life a lot of people get the chance to make their garden look that pretty and, and perfect. Very well done. You'll become a great farmer one day. Hmm. Just like you, Grandpa. Ha! Huh. Let's bring these inside and bake a huge carrot cake. Carrot cake. I haven't had carrot cake in quite some time. Would not mind a piece of that right now, let me tell you. Alright, so now we get to create our character. So we can create a boy or a girl. Uh, okay. I guess we'll go boy. Character name RC, fine. I thought the character building would be a little bit more involved, but when I was a kid, I loved visiting Grandpa's farm. These days, we write letters to stay in touch. But recently, he stopped replying. Uh-oh. That's not a good sign. Until this mysterious message arrived. Hopefully, it's good news. I mean, he looked old when you were a kid. I mean, look at the picture. So, man. DRC, I hope this letter finds you well. This may come as a surprise, but I want you to take over the farm. Please, come here as soon as you can. I will explain everything. Look at the little cute little pig running around. What happened here? Yeah, it looks like everything's been messed up. Help! This is a helper on the farm? Farm hand? Oh, hey, finally, I've been here for an hour. Please, let me get this off. 
It's too heavy. I can't. Grab one of the fallen branches, branches and use it for leverage. Okay. That's cool. In addition to this being a sort of... Uh, you know, uh, a casual farming game where you're planning stuff. Looks like they're actually incorporating some kind of story and interactive, like, pieces for that. That's really, really cool. Was not expecting that, actually. Okay, now try again. I gotta say, the little pig is very, very cute. Hooray! Let's have a chat. Thank you, I owe you one, RC. You... I'm sorry, have we met? It's me, Benny. We used to play as kids. Your grandpa Walter asked me to wait for you. I'm supposed to meet him here. He sent a letter about the farm. Whoa. Oh, right. I'm supposed to give you this key. Here, you go. And congratulations. The key for the house? Thanks. I hope grandpa's all right. Any idea where he went? No, he vanished just before the storm hit us. My father, Owen, might know more. He's at our place down the road. I just finished setting up the farm box for you before my little accident. It's on the road leading to our place. You can buy and sell goods there. I'll come around regularly to check on it. Hey, you're still trying to get my bearings. I haven't farmed anything in years. Why don't you try and buy some seeds? Once they're grown and harvested, you could sell the products. Oh, and check on the well. Looks like it took a beating from the storm. Okay, thanks, Benny. I will. All right, so we got some... Let's see, we got the well, we got Carpenter's Homestead. Oh, XP times one. High numbers. Uh, farmhouse, collect reward. Where did Benny set up the box again? I should check my notes. All right. I could check on important notes and hints anytime in my journal. Good to know. Can help guide me to where I need to go. Buy this item from these merchants. Track. Ah, yes, I remember. It's on the road towards the Carpenters. But we got other stuff to do here. Like, we got things to clean up. Okay, so we got 20 things we could run around and clean up and do. So let's go ahead and clean up first. Why not? It is part of a little quest we got going on there. Hey, level two. And we can turn these over. So we could plant potatoes, a second field area, or digging. I feel like digging's gonna be pretty important, right? We're planting potatoes? Or second field, I, I don't know. Let's go second field area, I guess. Having a second field area, probably, probably pretty important as well. All those seem like important things, though. Cleaning, cleaning. So everything I'm doing right now is controlled with the mouse. Uh, again, if you're looking for, you know, sort of a casual game that literally is just like a one one hand, one button game, everything so far has been interactive with just the mouse and clicking the left mouse button. So if that is an issue for you or if you're just looking for that style of game, something simple, this will be it for you. Okay, we need a key to open that. We're going to collect a stick. You get XP for collecting sticks, apparently, too. We got all kinds of stuff flashing over here. Okay, so we can't dig yet. That was the thing that we needed to dig. But we can clean. What's our little pig friend doing? What is that? He gave me some kind of coin, but I don't exactly know what that was. Like the music of this game is very pleasant, just like real nice to kind of again just fits the mood of casual kickback and farm. Kick back on the farm and just hang out a while. Have some lemonade, why don't you? Plant some carrots and potatoes too. All right, so we got some carrots here. So we need to buy, was it four? Even if not, we'll buy four. Okay, now we gotta repair the well, but we should plant the carrots first probably, huh? Planted. So 
So it seems like even though you gotta wait for vegetables at the moment, uh... That you're gonna have plenty of other, like, little tasks and secondary quests to do while you're waiting for these things to be done growing. So right now, we could just, like, keep cleaning up. We can go repair the well, like it says there. We only got four more pieces of rubble to clean up, so maybe we'll go do this first. Also looks like you can pick up this flower, harvest the flower. There's another chest tucked under this bridge over here, too. Something to keep in mind. Okay, so there's one more pile of rubble somewhere. But yeah, it's, uh, I mean, it, it controls like you would play, like, you know, as weird as a, <laughs> as a reference as it is, considering the, uh, the style of game we're playing here. But it controls very much like an action RPG, like a Diablo or something like that. So, if you're used to playing those types of games, that's what you got here. Hey, we can dig now. We're gonna go for digging. Oh, and there is the last pile. So let's clean that. We've done it! So we'll go chat with this guy. Hi again. How can I help you? Uh, left them about the mess. We cleaned it up. This is all the rubble we gathered while cleaning up. Can you make use of it? That's a lot. Let me see. Yes, there are some things that Owen and I can use for crafting. Thank you. Here, take these coins in exchange and you should keep some of the materials yourself. All right, cool. Uh, looks like he's got a lot of other things you could talk about too, but I am good. Yeah, and the conversation. Uh, we're gonna go harvest some stuff. I want to go use our new found digging thing. AKA shovel. Let's go dig this. Dig it, baby. Dig. Okay, interesting. So everything you do in here, whether you're digging, whatever it is, you are collecting resources and all kinds of stuff. So, all right, we got to repair the well. Uh, let's see, every few minutes the well produces more water until it is full. Take the water and use it to water your fields. Yep, let's unlock that well. And let's collect some water. And let's go harvest our carrots. Still growing. All right, so we gotta wait for that. So if we click down here, let's see, what do we got? Okay, we can look through. Okay, so these are your actual coins. That's what you're using to buy stuff. Uh, we do have a little pig. Okay, you can get other, other pets as well. There's a unicorn piglet, which is apparently locked. But if you want the corgi, let's see if you unlock pet. It says, after unlocking this pet, you'll be able to activate it immediately and let it search for treasure. You also unlock more information. So, if we wanted him, we click 120 treats. Common treat from level one, your pet can find this item as treasure, okay. All right, that's cool. So you can unlock other pets. And early access, they've only got access to a few uh, animals here, but... That's pretty fun. Uh, what else we got up here? Gathered items. Okay, so it does keep like a uh, sort of uh, record of like all the different things you're collecting and whatnot. Uh, increase storage limit by 50 coins. Oh, don't. I'm assuming that must mean there must be some microtransactions in this, but that didn't seem to work, did it? I was like, buy 150, you don't have enough coins. Oh, I, no, 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 my, doesn't look that way. You just don't have enough coins. I clicked that, didn't it say I could buy 50 though? Oh, that's, okay, so I did upgrade it because I had 50. I was really confused there because I was thinking like, is it asking me to buy coins? Yeah, I thought it was asking me to buy 50 coins. <laughs> I misread that. Interesting. Okay, I think we're good. Let's close that. How are we at with these? Here we go. So we get one carrot. 
And just wait a few seconds for the other ones. There they go. And I thought there was something else we could buy at the stand here, too. Oh, come on back. There we go. Oh, no, you can only... You can unload stuff there, but you can't... But okay, so we can only get carrots right now. So, um... At the moment... Because when I upgraded, it said you could plant potatoes then, but I guess you got to unlock that ability to do that. Okay, that's fair. And I, Oh, it looks like you can go fishing, too. Eventually, you'll be able to unlock fishing. All right, that's cool. I, I dig that. I like they add that stuff in there. Fishing is actually my favorite thing. Um, from, uh, like, Animal Crossing and stuff like that, but... All right, so if we want to sell four, we sold them. Keep hitting escape. If you hit escape, it brings up the menu every time. It doesn't, you know, pull you out of menus and whatnot. You got to actually close out of that yourself with the mouse. Hi again, can I help you? Yeah. Well done. Growing and selling your crop is what farm life is all about. And you did great. You can have these seeds. You're obviously much better at farming than I am. Oh, thanks, dude. What a compliment. I'm gonna grow some more carrots. It says to talk to Owen. Water it. And there we go. All planted. And, okay, we gotta wait 45 seconds for some more... ...water there. Okay, we gotta talk to Owen, so who is... Oh, we can fix the silo, too. Wow, you need a lot of money to fix that. Holy... Holy moly! Uh, so who is Owen? Somebody in this house? Wow, even to fix the house doesn't cost as much as to fix a silo. Why is the silo so expensive compared to the the house? I don't know. Alright, we're going to have to track this one because I have no idea where this guy is at. But we have a pig over here who's going to give us some coins. Alright, come on. Let's go. So that's what the pig is doing. When it jumps around there, it's actually finding stuff like treasure, like it said. There we go. Oh, looks like you have, like, a local town area, too, with a store and whatnot. Okay, that's fair. Hmm. So you're not just doing quests for your farm. You're going to be doing quests for other people as well. Can I help you? <laughs> buy that blasted win. Or the buy the blasted win if it isn't little RC. Well, not quite so little anymore. This is true. I am a full-fledged adult, I'll have you know. Your grandpa told me he was handing over the farm to you. Congratulations, thanks. But have you seen him by any chance, my grandpa? No, not for a while, actually. Your grandfather was acting a little strange recently. Very secretive, you know, but he might be with Mayor Connor in town. Unfortunately, we can't get into town at the moment. The storm destroyed the bridge. I hope he's all right. I saw Benny on our farm. He's going to keep looking there. That's my boy. But, that does mean we are one man short for the cleanup. Look at this place. Uh, yeah, sure. I can help. Talk to my wife, Amelia. She's organizing the cleanup. Okay. Hey. Hello, my dear. What can I do for you today? Cleanup crew, let's do this. Well, hello there. You must be RC. Your grandpa, Walter, told us to expect you. Indeed, ma'am. I'd like to help with the cleanup since Benny can't. It's very kind, but where is Benny? He stayed at our farm in case Grandpa comes back. He seems to be missing. Sorry to hear that, RC. I'm sure he's in town, safe with the mayor. They've been quite close lately. It's nice of you to want to help. Sam, look who it is. Remember RC? Oh. Hi, what are you doing here? RC has offered to help us clean up. Isn't that nice? Sure, I guess. Let's get started then. All right, let's go. We're doing a mini game here. Nope, this is just a cutscene thing. Okay. 
That should be enough cleaning. Let's get back to Sam. Hey, hey what's up? Great work. Ha. Thanks for helping and all. Of course, is there anything else I can do to help? Why are you being so nice? We're good here. <laughs> wow, rude. But if you're intent on being useful, maybe have a look at the shepherd's farm. My dad is headed there to see if they need help since they have small kids. I will. Thanks, uh -huh. Sam. See you, see you later. Uh, sure, whatever. Rude. All right, shepherd's farm. Up of this way. And another set of quests. It looks like they're looking for something. They're probably going to come to us and say, like, oh, could you find our insert farm animal here? I do really like the, the models for the animals. Like, the animals, I think, look really good uh, for, a, like, a kind of a low-poly, you know, style game going on here. They have really good uh, faces and animations and stuff. Pigs, the dog looks great. Owen, oh, please tell me, have you seen my son, Levy? Not since since before the storm, Jacob. What's happened? He's gone missing. Hannah tells me that he was out looking for rabbits before the storm hit us. I was so busy calming down the livestock that I didn't notice until it was too late. Don't you worry, Jacob. I'm sure he's fine. We'll help you search for the boy. This is R.C. He's helped us clean up after the storm. I thank you, Owen, R.C. To receive such kindness from a stranger is rare indeed. Let's see. Hannah and Lydia can uh, keep looking around here. I suggest we three head to the woods in the west. I'll join you in the woods, but first I must tell Benny about the situation. The twins are dear to him. He'll want to help. And we hit level four. Well, we're moving right along here, aren't we? Uh, let's see. We can... Is this mushrooms? Mycology? It looks like a mushroom. Uh, let's see. We're planting potatoes. And we can harvest a few of these things, because why not? What do we got over here? What was that? We have to look. Um, here we go. A pebble. We collected a pebble. Wonder what that's going to be used for. Okay, we need to search for Levi or Levy. How are they pronouncing it here? See, look at the even the chickens here. We can actually zoom in. I didn't know we could do that, but look at these chickens. They apparently love you. Look, <laughs> look how much they love you. But the the little animations of the chickens and the way they look and everything just looks. They did a really nice job on that. Um, same with uh, the cow here. Look at the cow. Here, turn around, cow. I want to see your face. Oh, we can't chop yet. Alright. Looks like we're going to the woods, so let's do it. Let's save Levi. Dog's trying to stiff him out. The woods. Look at little rabbits. Little rabbits look good, very cute. Oh no! No, the game actually crashed! Early access, guys, early access. Let's get back in there. We gotta find Levi. It was all because I went to harvest a mushroom. That's... <laughs> That's what happened. Alright. That's why they give you that big agreement at the beginning there where it's like, I understand that it's early access, right? Uh, the real question is, how far is this going to put us back? Okay, we're still searching for Levi. Okay, that's good. So we want to head to the Shepherd's Farm. Which looks like we can go up through this way. So it's good about saving your place, so that's good. Even though we, we crashed and we're coming back. It looks like it saved where we were pretty well. All right, let's see if we can still get the mushroom. Let's see if this is like a mushroom issue. Nope, that's the mycology. Okay, 
So if, next time I learn Mycology, then I can harvest that. Look at the little pig scamper around following you. It just looks so... Look at it. It's just so cute. Like, perfect animation. You guys have to forgive me, too. Like, I'm a big fan. I've talked about this on the channel, too. I'm a big fan of them. Uh, any, any company using wildlife in their games, so... Um, Anytime they can do wildlife and, and animals and uh, make really nice animations with them, I, I'm always a big fan of that. Well, he wasn't really hiding too far away, was he? Levi, I'm RC. My da your dad sent me out looking for you. Uh, my leg, it hurts so much. I went to play in the woods, but the ground is so wet from the storm, I slipped and fell on a rock. Yikes. That's no good. My leg hurts real bad. Just stay put. Try not to move. We'll get help and be right back. You're gonna be okay, I promise. All right. We found him. Let's go talk to these dudes. Hey. Oh, hello there. Can I help you? Yeah, we found him. Owen, oh, Jacob, please. I need you to come. Qu I need to. You need to come quickly. I found Levi. He's hurt. Poor lad. Thank you, RC. We'll bring him home. I will craft a leg splint so we can safely transport Levi. Please meet Lyd Lydia and me at our farm. Okay. We shall. Back to Shepherd's Farm. There's the cow. You can see the cow's face a little bit there. Oh, is it? Ex yeah, it loves me. Look, the cow loves me. Look at this cow. What a loving cow. Hi, cow. I've been wanting to ask you this for a while, but would you marry me? <laughs> All right. Enough of that. <laughs> anyway, um, let's grab that. Let's. Can we pet the dog? He wags his tail excitedly and looks at you happily. End conversation. You can't pet him? Come on, what is that? You put a dog in game- it's 2020. You put a dog in your game, you can always pet the dog. It's just a rule now, I think. Oh, father. Levi's temperature is way too high. You should call Dr. Gallon to treat him. Levi is strong, Lydia. Does he really need a doctor to pump chemicals into his body now? I don't know. I'm afraid our household remedies might not be enough. Hmm. I could go for the doctor, Mr. Shepard. I'd be happy to. The bridge was, was destroyed by the storm. We couldn't get the town lit to s summon the doctor anyway. But what should we do then? Lydia, you make the medicine for the fever, and I'll take care of the rest. Levi will get through this, I'm sure. Okay. This is a bit of XP. It's not bad. Oh, hello. Is there anything I can do for you? Uh, I've not had the chance to thank you properly for helping find uh, Levi. You're too kind. I do have another favor to ask of you. I'm missing an important ingredient for his medicine, but I loathe to leave his side. Uh, could you help collect some herbs for me? Yeah, sure. Alright, we are going to harvest some wildflowers. We gotta get some herb. Yeah, I did track it, right? You can produce the item at these buildings. I'm assuming we have to... Okay, we harvested the field, so we have to grow it, I'm assuming, first. Okay, so that's the woods. So back to our farm, because we got to go and grow. I assume that's the case here. Let's see, yeah, we can harvest that. And our carrots are done. Now, I don't remember seeing wildflowers as an option. We have potatoes now, which is cool. Why don't we buy some potatoes? We'll plant those, and then we'll go after the wildflowers and finish up that quest. I thought we'd be able to come over here and do the... Oh, the potatoes take much... Oh, no, here's the wildflowers. Here we go. Let's go pick up some more water. We'll do potatoes next. Uh, 
One more wildflower. Water it. And let's go do some other stuff while we wait here. Dig that up. Don't mind me, just getting some XP. You just watch it fish. I'm gonna get a fishing pole at some point and I'm going to be fishing you out of there. Go in my museum. So I doubt there's a museum here. It doesn't seem like there, that is a thing in this game. But there could be. But yeah, I, I feel like this game is a game that will really appeal to people who are fans of like games like Animal Crossing. I, myself, am a big fan of Animal Crossing. And so, like, this is already like hitting a pretty good note for me. Yeah, we're nowhere near. We need uh, roofing slates and lots of coins for that one. The silo we looked at at the beginning here, and that needed, yeah, 25,000 coins. That is a lot. And to fix the farmhouse. Oh, you just unlock it. Hey, look at that. One of the only detriments to this game is that because it's in early access right now, they have not added achievements. I'm sure you're gonna get achievements for this kind of thing. This feels like the kind of game that's gonna have tons and tons of achievements. We get another coin from our piggy here. But there are no achievements at the moment. We'll come back to that guy in a second here. We got some wildflowers that we gotta deliver here, don't we? There we go, one more. I was gonna say, that's the last one. Up we go. Okay, let's go turn this in. Chicken's are already sleeping. Hello, is there anything I can do for you? Oh yeah, we have these things for you. Thank you so much, RC. I will try my very best, but his fever has gotten even worse. Hope we can return the favor one day, RC. Collect some XP. But yeah, hopefully they'll be able to bring this kid out of it. It's terrible. This can't be good. This really can't be good. It's not helping. His temperature keeps rising. Can I do anything else to help? No, I don't think either of us can help him in this condition. Father, we have to send for the doctor now. I hear you, my child. I have misjudged, misjudged the situation, but it's not too late to correct my mistake. However, we can't get the doctor while the bridge is still impassable. Is there anything I can do? Use your help again, RC. Let's meet at the bridge with the others and get the repairs done. Okay, so we did that. And we're walking this way. It's already nighttime, though. And this way. Oh, and I know this is too much to ask, but Levi's condition is worsening. I need to call on Dr. Galen. Will you help me prepare the bridge? Of course we will, Benny. I am certain RC will help as well. We'll have it fixed in no time, Jacob. Don't you worry. All right, so we got bridge repair help. Oh, we could chop wood now. Cool. We're trying to rush the bridge construction, but we'll be needing a lot more materials. I'm happy to help. With the bridge fixed, not only can we get to get a doctor for Levi, but I can check on my grandpa as well. Right you are. Well then, put those arms to use. Here's an axe. Careful with it. We need more logs. And we are now level five. Uh, let's see. Mining rocks. I haven't seen that yet. Let's go mycology so that we can get mushrooms now. Very cool. All right, so we need to go find logs now, but... We are just over 30 minutes here, and I think that is where we're going to end here for today. Um, this actually, like I said, is a pretty cool little casual farming game. I, I dig it. I think uh, there's definitely, you know, a lot to be had here for someone who is a fan of this style of game. Um, 
Obviously, uh, this is going to appeal, like I said, to a very particular person. And that person probably being somebody who is a already a fan of like a farming simulator game or somebody who's looking for uh, something a little bit more casual just to kick back and play for a bit, you know? Uh, and of course, Animal Crossing fans like myself. Big into Animal Crossing. I am still playing New Horizons to this day. Um, and this is, uh, you know, kind of in the same vein, just without... Uh, the talking animals. You still have animals though. Cute little piggy here. Very cute pig. You gotta admit. <laughs> very, very wonderful, cute, beautiful little piggy piggy. Piggy piggy piglet. Anyway, guys, uh, I just want to say thank you for watching. Um, this is Big Farm Story. We're checking out if you're looking for this style of game. Uh, this is the kind of game like that I play on nights where I'm like, you know, I don't feel like playing anything too demanding of my brain or too demanding uh, of me, you know, concentration wise. It's something I can kind of like play in the background while I'm listening to a podcast or, or watching a movie on Netflix or something like that. Um, but yeah, I think it's pretty cool, actually. Uh, but guys, again, thank you for watching. And of course, I'll see you all next time.